Our focus on this school is fostering learning through the arts. And so that's our theme. So you'll see some of the murals represent the mm -hmm. arts. Um, and because we really focus on um, infusing that into our core curriculum. Children need the arts. Uh, the arts allow them to express their creativity. Um, it also is, there's research that supports that the arts actually help with critical thinking skills. And it's a first grade classroom and they have the wonderful opportunity to use these iPads to learn to read. They play educational math, reading, literacy, phonics games, and this is another thing that has helped my class to read better because they're playing and they don't know they're learning. The blue jay is easy to see. It is bright blue on the top and it is white on the bottom. Watch a duck. It can be fun. A duck looks for food. It may um, Home Depot was one of our partners. We want some of our kids to grow up and go be the manager there. Office Max, and I'll show you, they, Office Max came and remodeled our entire staff room in one day. Our bathrooms got remodeled by the Boston Celtics. Access Books is a company I had never heard of before who does give away books to schools. The Food Network and Giada De Laurentiis from Everyday Italian, um, she, this is her garden. Yeah, carrots right here, right. this is the carrots right here. Um, a big part of building partners is developing a relationship and um, seeing what we could benefit from them, but also seeing how they could benefit from us. Hi, scholars. How are you? Good. Oh, thank you. My goodness. This is another reason why I come to work. You know, I'm born and raised in Los Angeles. There's not many of us left. Everybody here is from somewhere else. So when people say that, I feel like a foreigner. <laughs> I thought I was going to be, you know, like, you know, the leader of the school. <laughs> and I found out I'm a servant. <laughs> what I love about this job is I'm more than just a principal. I feel like I'm a counselor. Um, I have learned to be a big sister, an aunt, a friend, in some cases, a daughter to some of the older parents I meet. One of my teachers has music. He's a musician. He does this outside of work, but now he's brought it to work. Let's see him. The arts is a part of life. Um, they don't always know their gifts, talents, and abilities. And by providing the arts here on campus, um, particularly for free, um, it allows them to find a God-given gift that they have at, down within them that they don't know. Right, right, that's what I told her. But she said since Ms. D let us borrow one of the laptops so that she had, so buy by, by one. But parent engagement means now they have a stake in the community, they have a stake in the school, they are part of the school governance, they're giving um, their ideas and helping guide that ship in the way that it should go. We feel it is our duty to also help educate them, um, to show them ideas, um, let them be a part of what we're doing so that what we're doing is replicated back at home. I think this is ready to be harvested, right? I'm always ready to harvest. I'm always hungry when I come through here. And the garden is, a, a, the I think, the heart of the school over. now um, okay. because it That's allows right. us to get outside, right, when you guys say that? Yeah. Um, yeah. Put our hands in nature, actually see something grow. One thing I do with my strawberries, I grill them up and I put them on the steak and it tastes really good. Oh. And I used to be chubby, but now I'm getting skinnier because I'm only eating healthy stuff. Foster stands on the foundation um, of creativity and self-expression. This is a school where children find who they are and find their gifts, talents, and abilities that they didn't scholars. even know existed. What's up? One, two, three. Learning Garden! Yes, the Learning Garden is on. It rocks, right? Yes. <laughs>